Avoiding situations that make you nervous will only help you feel comfortable for a short period of time. The more often you avoid a certain situation, the more anxious you're going to become when you're faced with it yet again in your life. This happens with school, with work, with romantic relationships, family relationships, and in other areas of our life. So the reason why your anxiety is increasing every time you avoid a situation is because you virtually have no practice with it. It's by trying something new and finding out something about ourselves that helps us feel a little bit more confident, feel a little bit more capable when that situation or something like it shows up in our life again. Now, avoiding is natural for humans, right? We have this tendency, especially children. Children act this way to keep themselves safe. It's scary to try something new. Hopefully, children have adults around them who are trustworthy, who encourage children to then push past their nerves and try something new. And once they've tried it, they know what to expect. And hopefully, they'll do it again. But who helps adults who are struggling and sort of trapped in the cycle of avoiding and waiting and avoiding and waiting? Meanwhile, their anxiety is so high. Well, I'm Angela. I do virtual therapy as part of the Lighthouse Emotional Wellness Center team. I work with clients who are struggling with anxiety, especially those who find themselves avoiding something specific or avoiding a lot of things in their life. It's by picking up that ax that we can then attack the wall of anxiety you're experiencing. Talking it out is helpful. We can use mindfulness techniques. And basically, we'll find out what works for you to help decrease and really get rid of that tendency to avoid something new. I operate on the belief that practice really does make perfect. Reach out to the Lighthouse Emotional Wellness Center so that you can schedule a virtual session with me, Angela, the Anxiety Coach.